Okay, Assalamualaikum uh, Testing, testing uh, Can you hear my voice? Boleh dengar suara saya tak? Boleh dengar suara saya dengan jelas tak? Please uh, response eh Sebab Saya nak Nak tahu Sama ada you uh, Boleh dengar suara saya dengan jelas atau tidak Okay, thank you uh, Remy So Uh, now it's four o'clock uh, without any uh, delay I will start the, the lecture today okay uh, this is for FIN 5, 552 yeah? FIN 552 uh, investment analysis and portfolio management yeah? um, so this is our first lecture um, so uh, for today I'll just uh, give you uh, some overview uh, what are the things to be expected throughout the whole semester yeah um, as you as all of you are aware of actually uh, I have made a, a video as, uh, based on uh, past semester I mean last semester's uh, lectures uh, I have uh, uh, almost a complete uh, collection of Lectures uh, consists of about 53 series of lectures. Eh? Uh, I have uploaded some of the uh, some of the uh, lectures in my in my uh, YouTube channel. Uh, look at my playlist. So far, I have uploaded uh, uh, four series, uh, four series of lectures on on this subject. Um, for this semester, of course, I cannot simply Uh, tell my students okay just uh, watch the videos that i have recorded that would be unfair to 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 you eh? jadi uh, what i'm going to do is i'm going to repeat more or less repeat the lectures that i have uh, produced uh, based on uh, uh, last semester's lectures series of lectures but uh, uh, as much as possible i try to uh, to give Uh, I, I try to deliver the lectures in English. Yeah? Uh, throughout this uh, this semester, our lectures will be in English. Of course, sometimes uh, uh, we need we need to revert to Bahasa Malaysia, uh, sprinkles of Bahasa Malaysia, sedikit sedikit lah Bahasa Malaysia, uh, to explain especially on the uh, more uh, technical uh, concept. So probably uh, our class would consist of, I mean our lectures would consist of probably around 90% English and between 5% to 10% uh, in Bahasa Malaysia. So that uh, you have the choice to watch my lecture in, in English and my lectures in Bahasa Malaysia, in, in Malay, uh, uh, by, by watching the videos that I have recorded eh, and I have uh, uploaded uh, in my YouTube channel okay um, uh, so I have uh, uh, I have uh, uh, given the the class schedule I mean the the lecture schedules one hour per day for for this yeah and so far I have not received any any complaints or any 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 problems from uh, from the from all of you eh, from the four groups of students uh, so i assume that you do not have any problem with the time fixed eh? uh, one hour a day uh, we do not have any lecture on on thursday yeah okay um, so there are a few things that uh, i would like to talk about before we continue with the lecture proper yeah uh, syarahan sebenar mungkin probably we'll start tomorrow uh, regarding the things uh, there are a few things that you need to know uh, first is regarding the textbook i think uh, everybody knows everybody is aware of that we will be using this textbook yeah i have uh, shared the uh, the the photo of the textbook I mean the the front page of the textbook uh, in our WhatsApp groups, and um, I'm not sure how 
how to get the textbook. Uh, students know better than me in getting the textbook. Uh, probably you can get it from, I don't know, since all of you are scattered, eh? all of you are scattered from uh, all over Malaysia. So I assume that all, almost all of you are, are off campus. I mean, I mean, you don't come to campus, right? Uh, unlike some of the diploma students, but there are about 500 uh, over students in Machang campus, on campus. I mean, they, they, they stay in, uh, in campus, but as far as I know, degree students, almost all degree students are based at home. So you are uh, living all over Malaysia, all of you live in all, all over Malaysia, and I do not know how you get this textbook eh? so probably usually uh, you used to get the textbook from the corporasi kan? corporasi or something like that uh, but somehow students know how to get the textbook okay what if you do not have the textbook yeah uh, is it okay because i know the te the, 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 te the textbook is it's quite expensive i do not know the price but Close to 100 ringgit. Eh? Try to get it uh, from your seniors so that probably you can get um, a second hand price, <coughs> use textbook price, which is probably cheap, much cheaper than you buy a brand new. Okay, uh, if you do not have the textbook, of course, preferably everybody should have the textbook, but I know the constraints, you have the financial constraints. Uh, the textbooks are expensive and so on etc if you do not have the textbook the textbook i will try my very best uh, to help you in i mean in terms of providing the uh, the, the lectures some of the some of the uh, some of the materials uh, from this textbook that if you really need it uh, sometimes i photocopy it and i upload it uh, in Last semester, I, load, I upload it on WhatsApp, but this semester, I intend to upload some of the important materials uh, from the textbook through UFuture. We'll talk, we'll talk about UFuture later on eh? in, this, uh, this, uh, in this class. Okay, so uh, this is compulsory textbook. Okay, um, the second thing is uh, you need a financial calculator, right? So I know everybody, student, uh, finance students have no problem. You, everybody has a financial calculator, but I guess even Islamic banking students also have financial calculator. Eh? Uh, BA2 plus, BA2 plus financial calculator. Uh, you need the financial calculator. What if you do not have a financial calculator? If you do not have a financial calculator, you will probably have, probably will have some trouble uh, in some of the topics, especially on bond valuation later on eh? bond valuation you need a financial calculator uh, to calculate the, the the value of the bond and duration bond duration okay uh, this this is a second thing that you need to have okay the third thing is that uh, you you need to have a complete uh, complete uh, collection of past semester's questions eh? uh, past semester's questions uh, on FIN 552 and um, as I mentioned in my uh, my BM version of uh, uh, my BM uh, version of a video recording uh, uh, last semester's re video recording the introductory part actually um, FIN 552 code has just been introduced to your ATM if I am not mistaken, this is probably the, the fourth or the fifth semester. Previously, we did not have FRN 552. Okay, so if you uh, try to retrieve the past semester's questions, you can only go, the earliest is probably about two or, two or three or four semesters back, FRN 552. Uh, previously, we had FRN 661. So, um, FRN 552 is basically uh, is a FRN 661 
and a combined and uh, uh, about eighty percent of FIN six six one content is reintroduced back to FIN five five two. Plus another twenty percent content of FIN five five two is taken from FIN five four eight. This I I I have explained in my Basem Malaysia video. Eh, if uh, I, I, if you watch the Basem Malaysia video, pun you uh, you I, I have explained to you all these things. Yeah. So there are certain topics that um, so so you might ask. So how do I uh, which which uh, which past message questions that you need to uh, to upload? I would advise you to upload the past ten semesters of uh, past message questions. Of course, uh, FIN five five two we have about four or five semesters only, uh, maybe less because uh, for the past two semesters, uh, 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 last semester uh, we had uh, an final assessment. Last two semesters, we did not have final assessment. So probably two or three semesters of FIN five five two questions. So uh, previously we had FIN six six one. So when I when we discuss past semester question, we will discuss uh, uh, the uh, the ten most recent uh, questions, the ten most recent past semester questions for FIN six six one. Okay. Paham tak? Saya pun nak cakap pun uh, Belik-belik cakap orang putih ni Tetapi uh, What I'm trying to say is That You Photocopy The past Tens uh, Ten semesters questions Of FIN 661 And FIN 552 So it should be a Continuously lah Continuously Okay um, uh, That is another uh, Past semester question And I have actually um, uh, upload uh, the. I'm not sure whether I have saved it, but probably I have saved it. All the answer schemes eh? uh, for FIN 661 and FIN 552 answer schemes, so that um, I will upload all these answer schemes. Uh, question paper you uh, you can upload through uh, Equip Thread right? library uh, library, but the answer scheme uh, you you. You have to get it from me, the answer scheme. I will upload the answer scheme in in U Future. I think everybody is aware of U Future, so you can get it from U, U uh, from U Future. Yeah, uh, but I have not uploaded yet. Uh, I'm not sure whether I have saved all the uh, past messages questions that I have retrieved, and if I have saved it, I will upload it in U Future, and you can get it from U Future. Okay, and that is uh, regarding the past message questions and answer scheme. Okay, the, 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 next, the next thing that you have to know that um, for this semester also, um, you have to play a Busa Marketplace game. Yeah? So that counts for quite a substantial uh, percentage of your, uh, your final marks. Yeah? Uh, I will brief you later on how to join the game because uh, I have uh, to create the game first before you can join the game. But um, uh, never mind. For the time being, um, uh, you have to know that you everybody uh, needs to play the game because uh, quite a substantial percentage of your final grade will be based on the game that you play. Uh, you have to play the game and then you have to later on towards the end of the semester uh, everybody uh, has to uh, make a presentation yeah uh, make a presentation uh, based on the game uh, that would be uh, towards the end of the semester lah, yeah towards the end of the semester um, about this busa marketplace game uh, some students, uh, uh, they, they do not care much about joining the game and uh, especially the previous, uh, the previous two semesters, some students, they, they did not bother to register for the game 
and that will cost you a lot of marks your final grade yeah uh, so make sure you play the game uh, of course later on i will uh, I, I will uh, give you uh, i will give i will brief you on how to uh, play the game and how the presentation will be graded yeah uh, based on uh, the game that you play okay um what else eh? um i think that's about it unless i can think of something else let me see if you have any question do you have any question uh what else eh? uh we have talked about oh how about the carry marks eh? uh carry marks and the uh, um the syllabus yeah you can get it uh the syllabus you can get the syllabus from uh from aims yeah uh you can get the syllabus from aims uh i do not strictly follow the the assessment as stated in the syllabus yeah if you i have the the older version of the syllabus let me see if i have the the latest version of syllabus I don't strictly follow the the syllabus. I I do make some uh, some modification, yeah? uh, some modification on the on the assessment. Yeah. If uh, later later on, I will share with you the assessment as given to to the lecturers maybe you can see from here i will share with you later so if you look at the assessment here yeah uh, can you see it um we'll have um two tests and we have group project individual pre project presentation and final examination yeah final examination uh, instead of two tests uh, we'll have three tests no sir oh, okay no question eh? uh, okay uh, instead of three tests i mean instead of two tests i will uh, conduct three tests but uh, there won't be any group project uh, because uh, because you are li uh, living so far apart from each other it's a bit difficult in my opinion for you to to form a group to discuss uh, to discuss the the group project and so on so i replace that with another test but uh, you have to uh, you have to perform uh, you have to to uh, to prepare a one individual presentation based on the bursa marketplace game later on yeah uh, don't worry about it because uh, I will uh, brief you in details later on. So all together we'll have three tests, one presentation, and one final exam. And the details assessment I'll give it to you later on. Um, for the past two semesters, uh, tests uh, will be conducted uh, through Google Classroom and uh, based on multiple choice questions so you are so lucky this uh, uh, during this COVID-19 uh, pandemic students are so lucky because uh, you do not have to take to take the test in a real setting yeah no wonder uh, last two semester students results 
are so excellent because you are answering the question at home probably you uh, with the help of other people other other people or and with the help of textbook this is like, like a op open open uh, book test yeah? open textbook test so you have it easy as compared to your seniors who have to sit for the final exam in the hall and with a uh, full uh, uh, with full uh, what do you call it uh, supervision of the invigilators so nak buat balik nak masuk toyol ke apa benda pun susah sini tak payah toyol sebab uh, semua ada dalam textbook jadi last semester last last two semesters test was tests were conducted through multiple choice questions and uh, using a google, a google classroom platform yeah uh, last two semester there was no final exam uh, recent semester this uh, just concluded semester we had a uh, final exam they don't call it final exam they, they call it final assessment more or less but final exam juga and uh, most of my students uh, perform very well uh, in the final exam as I mentioned just now uh, you can open the textbook you do not have to memorize formulas you can look at the formula you can google the answers and so on so uh, I do not know how efficient this technique of teaching and learning as compared to face-to-face -face and classroom tests but uh, given the circumstances this is the best that we can do eh? hopefully this COVID-19 will go away and we will I will back will will back to uh, old ways of doing things face to face uh, teaching and so on okay so if this semester ends just like uh, last semester uh, there won't be any face-to-face uh, -face interaction with my students so uh, tests would be conducted online using Gla uh, Google Classroom platform and uh, multiple choice questions except for the final assessment final assessment uh, uh, it is a subjective question uh, you have to answer the question upload it uh, to, uh, you have to change the format to PDF and upload it to the lecturers for the lecturer to mark okay so that would be the test I'll, I will I um, uh, will give you the the breakdown of the uh, assess, uh, uh, the, uh, the breakdown of marks for each test later on yeah test and assignment and so on okay uh, so far I think I have nothing else to say unless you have questions if you have any questions please feel to ask me the questions and if you are not comfortable asking the question in English you can answer you can ask the question in Bahasa Melayu but in Malay and I can answer it in English no problem I write uh, your questions now if you have anything you want to ask do you have any question Uh, do you have any question? No question? Okay, uh, if you do not have any question, um, I think, I guess that's about it for today. And for tomorrow's class, we will start with, uh, we'll start with attendance pun macam semester lepas ke, sir? Kiranya saya akan anggap semua ada. Oh, you tahu eh, semester lepas macam mana eh? Okay, uh, it's a bit difficult for me to uh, to take your attendance because uh, because um, some of you might have something crop up during the live. Some of you cannot join live because of th uh, because of other commitment. But you can watch the video later. So I have no way of knowing whether. You attend the, I mean, by attending means by watching the videos. Uh, so I have no way of knowing whether you watch the videos or not. Because if you, even if you do not, so if you do not 
at, uh, if you do not join our live session, you can watch the video later on. So, uh, you sebut betul lah. Um, apa ni, macam, macam semester lepas, I assume, eh, I assume that everybody watch my videos. Of course, in in uh, in reality, I know that no, uh, not everybody watch the videos. Uh, but, I have no way of knowing. So, berbaik sangka lah eh. Okay. Uh, the second question is, uh, boleh tak sediakan slide untuk setiap chapter pada kami? Oh, tak boleh lah. Saya bahagian-bahagian slide-slide ni, satu, one thing is, saya ni tak berapa sangat rajin. Eh? I'm not that, uh, uh, tu tak berapa sangat rajin. Saya tak ada slide. Yang keduanya adalah, uh, I know some of some lecturers, Uh, they do provide slides to the students. They do provide a very big, uh, a very complete notes eh, uh, to the students. Uh, saya tak macam tu. Uh, unfortunately lah. Unfortunately, I'm not that type of lecturer. Uh, dan why why don't I give my students slides or why don't I give my students uh, notes? Eh? Notes. The reason is that. Uh, My emphasis is, you know what, this, this you, you probably agree with me, uh, when you get slides or notes from your lecturers, what you do, what you usually, what you usually do is you memorize the, the things that are in the slides, PowerPoint slides or whatever. That is, there's nothing wrong with memorizing things given in the slides or in the notes. But the thing is, um, I always emphasize to my students that you need to understand the thing. Uh, okay. Uh, you need to understand the concept, not memorizing the concept. If you understand things, if you understand things, uh, it is much, much easier for you to, uh, to write down the concept. Uh, After all, with these uh, Googles and so on, uh, you ha you don't have any difficulty finding, let's say for example, the meaning of each term. No problem with that. But the problem is how to tie up all these ideas together. That would be the problem. I have a daughter studying in UITM actually. Uh, she's doing her, her diploma in accountancy yeah? uh, in Machang. I always tell her, yeah, I always tell her that Uh, you need to understand the concept before you can write it down. Um, you have to understand and once you understand the concept, you do not need to write the, the, the thing just like given in the slides. You can use your own words. Doesn't matter if your, if your grammar is haywire, bertaburan kan it does not matter as long as the concept is clear okay so uh, the, the the problem with uh, uh, providing the slides is that stu students tend to memorize and of course there are certain subjects which in which uh, having slides will probably helpful subjects like marketing or management and to a certain extent uh, uh, marketing management what else and uh, uh, Economics probably, but quantitative su subjects like finance, uh, having slides does having slides do not really uh, do not really help you much, except you under except unless you understand the concept. Uh, so minta maaf lah, I do not provide you the, with the beautiful slides, uh, but I, I'm a, a quite an old-fashioned man. <laughs> I use whiteboard and Uh, marker. Yeah? Sorry, Raimi, uh, if that disappoints you. Okay, uh, saya secakap tadi, secakap tadi, secakap tadi syllabus boleh tengok kat mana ya? Dekat UITM Curriculum Management ke? Okay, uh, there are two, I have actually upload the syllabus in UFuture. You you go into my uh, my folder, Muhammad Jais, yeah? and I have, uh, there's no password, you can upload the 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 uh, uh, syllabus in your future or you can go to aims yeah i do not know whether you can 
uh, you can see from here. Uh, I, I think every student knows this, but uh, you can go to AIMS. Oh, ni. And you can get the silly uh, Do you know how to go to AIMS? Eh? AIMS UITM. You just Google AIMS UITM. And, uh, and then you can get the syllabus. Or, uh, so, so you can get it from your future. I have upload, I have upload the, the syllabus in your future. Or I can show you uh, this computer takes a bit of time to... I do not know whether you can see from there. Ya lambat sikit ni. Tak apalah, tunggu eh sekejap. Oh, maybe uh, I can give you I can share the syllabus in WhatsApp lah. Uh, so you have you have so many ways of getting the syllabus. I can share in a WhatsApp group lah. Uh, so yang ni pun lambat kan. I can share the syllabus with you in the WhatsApp group. No problem with that. In the meantime, if you have any question, you can ask the question. You can type the question. Okay, you go to AIMS UITM. A-I-M-S UITM. Can you see from there? Okay. And then, uh, when you type AIMS UITM, then you... You get uh, log in your ATM curriculum management and so on. There's no need for you to log in anything. So you get something like this. Eh? Oh, this is log in. Uh, no, no, no. Not this one. Uh, AIMS your ATM. Your ATM curriculum management. And then here we have... Prog uh, can you see from here? You have... AIMS your ATM. You have programs. Programs. And then courses, click to courses, and then you FIN 552. Type FIN 552, then type enter. And you get uh, FIN 552 investment management assist, and you get the syllabus. Uh, so you print or you download. Kalau susah, I'll share with you in the WhatsApp group. Lah. It's easier. Yeah. I share with you in the WhatsApp group. The syllabus. Okay. Um, do you have any other question? Do you have any other question? What else? Huh? Um, let me think for a while. What else to say in this class? In this introductory class? Oh, uh, one more thing is that uh, I make sure you get your yourself registered for the for uh, the class eh? uh, make sure you get uh, uh, your yourself registered for the class because um, I will print the sims I mean sims is uh, the list of students in each group I hope that nobody is left out because I will be based uh, uh, the number uh, because we have we lecturers have to make report on uh, how many how many students that we teach in each group of class and so on so that I have to get the the exact numbers so those of you who have yet to register please do so as soon as possible and another thing is that uh, for, 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 for D if I end for D uh, I'm supposed to 4D, eh? if I'm not mistaken, 4D or 4C? 4D, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I'm supposed to to have a sharing with uh, Prof. Nori, uh, Professor Madia Dr. Noriza. 4D, right? 4D. But I have talked with her. I have, I, have, I have had a discussion with her. Then we agree that I will teach 4D uh, throughout the semester until the end. Because... Uh, 
uh, if you want to split it first half of the semester I'll be teaching second half of the semester she'll be teaching so probably uh, I apa? probably takes a bit of adjustments on part of the students lah yeah so uh, professor Madia Dr Noriza actually uh, shows my student in UiTM Machang uh, in Cik Rustam Cik Rustam is her classmate lah Cik Rustam Rustam Syari your lecturer kan uh, so uh, uh, Dr Noriza was Cik Rustam's classmate that was in 1990 way back in 1996 uh, 1996 uh, she was in the second batch of finance students Kelantan second batch or first batch I I I I, I cannot remember exactly okay uh, what else do you have any question what else do you want to ask you can ask now if you have any question so do you have any question? If you do not have any question, okay, so anything, uh, let's say for example, if you, now you, you cannot think of a question, suddenly, tonight, you think of something you want to ask me, no problem, just message me, WhatsApp me, whether uh, in private or in, in groups, no problem, and I will answer your question, uh, if the questions benefits uh, all students, I will answer it in in class. If the questions is quite personal, uh, saya biasanya tak boleh jawab lah kan. Uh, kan? Uh, tak ada soalan dah kot. Okay, kalau tak ada soalan, if you do not have any question, uh, have a good rest. Uh, tak lama kita nak puasa dah. So, starting tomorrow, we'll start our our first lecture with the first topic which is uh, investment and securities market eh? uh, investment and securities market ni this is this will be the first topic then uh, overview of investment primary and secondary market ipo and market indices and so on etc so i'll see you again tomorrow uh, assalamualaikum warahmatullahi taala wabarakatuh